Hello everyone and how are you doing today? My name is Mr. Oba and I hope you are having a lovely day. In the previous class, we talked about machines and we said machines are equipment that make work easy. Our topic for today is uses of common simple machines. Uses of common simple machines. So, what are the machines you have in your home and how do you use them? Um, a good example of machines that we have in our home are the cleaning tools and the gardening tools. The cleaning tools that makes cleaning easy and the gardening tools that makes gardening easy. A good example of cleaning tools in our home is a broom and dustpan. And um, this is what a broom and a dustpan looks like. Broom and dustpan. They are mostly used in combination with each other. Broom and dustpan. So, what do you use a broom and dustpan to do? So, broom and dustpan are used to sweep dirt in our homes. So, you use the broom to sweep the dirt into a pile and you use the dustpan to pack it. So, broom is a cleaning tool that we use to clean dirt and dust in our home. But um, when you're using the broom and dustpan, sometimes you can be allergic to dust and you can react to dust. So in that case, when you're sweeping using broom and dustpan, make sure to use your nose mask. Nose mask. Another example of a cleaning tool in our home is the vacuum cleaner. Vacuum cleaner. This is what a vacuum cleaner looks like. Sometimes it is called Hoover. Hoover. Vacuum cleaner is used to suck up dust and dirt in our home, especially if you have carpets in your home. Vacuum cleaner is used to suck up dust and dirt in our home. And you can see an example of a va vacuum cleaner in use. If, uh, this is an example of a vacuum cleaner used to suck up dirt and dust from a carpet. Another good example of a cleaning tool in our home is the washing machine. The washing machine. The washing machine is a good example of a cleaning tool in our home. And what do you use washing machine to do? Can I hear you? Washing of laundries. And what is laundry? Laundry is your dirty clothes and your dirty linen. Your dirty clothes and your dirty linen. So washing machine is used to wash a dirty cloth or a dirty linen. Yep. So we can see that we use simple machines as a cleaning tool in our home. Also, we use simple machines as gardening tool in our homes. We use simple machines as gardening tool in our home. And a good example of a gardening tool is the shovel. The shovel. The shovel is a good example of a gardening tool. And what do you use the shovel to do? What do you use the shovel to do? So the shovel is used to dig the ground or to move large dirt and shrubs in our garden. Also, a good example of a gardening tool is the wheelbarrow. The wheelbarrow. And what is the wheelbarrow used for? The wheelbarrow is used to move materials from one spot to another. So if you have large dirt, large materials in your garden, you use the wheelbarrow to move them from one spot to another. Another good example of a gardening tool is the manual edge trimmer. Manual edge trimmer. The manual edge trimmer is like a large scissors used to cut, to trim and to prune. Um, this is an example of what it is used for. The manual edge trimmer is used to cut, to trim, or to prune shrubs in our garden. The manual edge trimmer is used to cut, to trim, or to prune shrubs in our garden. So this is, these are all examples of common simple machines in our home. So I want you to go to your parents and ask them of the cleaning tools and the gardening tools you have in your home. Thank you very much for joining us today and have a lovely day. Bye-bye.